to graph this linear function, pwede natin siyang isulat as y is equal to 2x minus 3. So, f of x is just the same with y. And then, sometimes, yung values ng x ay given na. So, kung walang values ng x, kahit anong number actually pwede nyo gamitin. Halimbawa, I want to use 0, 1, and 2. So, we'll be using this values of x to find the value of y through this equation. So, paano yan? Simulan natin sa unang value ng x, which is 0. So, x is equal to 0. Itong 0 na to, na value ng x, gagamitin natin tong equation na given para makuha yung value ng y by substituting. So, it will become y is equal to 2. Then, x, this one, will become 0. So, we'll change it with 0 minus 3. And then, so. So, we have now 2 times 0. That will be 0. Minus 3. This will just be equal to negative 3. So, yung negative 3, yun yung unang value ng y. Lalagay natin yan dito. Sa baba ng 0. Kasi ginamit natin yung value ng x, which is 0, to get this negative 3. Next, ituloy natin. So, dito naman tayo sa pangalawa, which is x is equal to 1. So, x equal to 1. Again, we will use this equation, y is equal to 2x minus 3. So, magiging y equals 2 instead of writing x. Gagamitin natin yung value ng x, which is 1. Then, minus 3. Then, so. So, 2 times 1, that is 2. Copy negative 3. And 2 minus 3, this will give us negative 1. So, it means, yun yung pangalawang value ng y. Negative 1. Then, let's continue. Yung pangatlong value ng x, that is equal to 2. We will just be doing the same method. Yung equation na to, papalitan lang natin yung value ng x. So, magiging y is equal to 2 times 2, because 2 is the value of x, minus 3. So, I just copied this equation. Then, so, 2 times 2, you'll have an answer of 4 minus 3. So, 4 minus 3, you will have a positive 1. So, this positive 1 will be the third value of y. Okay, since we have completed already this table of values, pwede na natin siyang i-graph. Paano? So, i-form muna natin yung ordered pair. Meron tayong dyang tatlong ordered pair. Saan ito manggagaling? Siyempre, dito sa values ng x at ng y. So, una, sa unang column, so we have 0 for x and negative 3 for y. Itong dalawa. Pangalawa, we have 1 for x at yung kapartner niya ay negative 1. Alright? Then, the third one, we have 2 for x and then positive 1 for y. So, ito na yung tatlong ordered pairs na gagamitin natin para ma-graph natin yung line. Before we plot the points, ito po yung Cartesian plane. Yung horizontal, yun yung x-axis. Yung vertical, yun yung y-axis. Lahat ng nasa kaliwa ng x ay negative. Lahat naman ng nasa baba ng y ay negative din. Simulan natin. So, 0 and negative 3, 0 for x. Negative 3 for y. So, pababa. 1, 2, 3. This will be our first point. Next. 1 for x and negative 1 for y. So, 1 for x, positive 1, papunta sa kanan. Negative 1 sa y. So, pababa. Nang isang beses lang. This will be our second point. And for the third ordered pair, we have 2 and 1. 2 for x. So, 1, 2. And positive 1 for y. So, isang pataas yun. 1. Alright. Okay, so yun na yung tatlong ordered pairs. Pwede na nating ma-drawing yung ating line. Connect lang natin yung 3 point. So this is the graph of the function f of x is equal to 2x minus 3. Mag-try pa tayo yung isa. So graph this f of x is equal to 4x minus 10. So again, we may write this as y is equal to 4x minus 10. Alright. And as you can see, in the table of values we have here, meron ng values ng x. So, hindi na natin kailangan mag-isip ng numbers. Gagamitin natin tong 1, 2, and 3 to solve for the values of y. Let us start. 
the first value of x is equal to 1, so x is equal to 1. Again, we will use this equation to substitute. So it will become y is equal to 4x, so x will become 1 because that is the first value of x minus 10. All right. 4 minus 1, that's 4 minus 10. And 4 minus 10 will give us negative 6. So we'll have negative 6 here. Okay, next value of x is positive 2. So x is equal to positive 2. Then let's use this equation to substitute y is equal to 4x. So x will become positive 2 minus 10. So, so 4 times 2, that's 8, minus 10. You will have an answer of negative 2. So, negative 2 is the second value for y. And for the third value of x, which is 3, so x is equal to 3. Use this equation, y is equal to 4. x will become 3 because it's the value of x, minus 10. Alright, so 4 times 3, that's 12 minus 10. 12 minus 10, that is positive 2. So 2 is the third value of y. Okay, now we have completed the table of values. Pwede nating kuhanin yung mga ordered pairs. So yung unang pair, we have 1 and negative 6. Pangalawa, we have 2 and negative 2. And ang pangatlo, we have 3 and positive 2. Okay, let's plot the point. Again, the horizontal is x, the vertical is y-axis. So, we have 1 and negative 6. 1 for x, so here is 1. Negative 6, so pababa yan. No? Magkaon tayo pababa. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Alright, this will be our first point. Next, 2 and negative 2. 2 for x, so 1, 2. And negative 2 for y, pababa ulit kasi negative 1, 2. Okay. The second point. And the third point, we have 3 and 2. So 3 for x, 1, 2, 3. And positive 2 for y, so pataas na yan kasi positive. 1, 2. Okay. So now, we already have the three points. Pwede na natin i-connect yung tatlong points to form the line. So this is the line of the function 4x minus 10. 